Whoa, that was one big party last night. How did I end up here? <laughs> Where did this hat come from? Huh, it fits. Looks like Viking failed. Yeah, all right. Well, <laughs> let's get hunting. Lost track of the forest to the trees, forgot what I was chasing. Spent so many nights living out at sea that my heart has gone vacant. And everybody who was close to me all stayed on dry land. So now I'm driving back on in the state west. I just gotta feel something. Not gonna wait till the morning because something's gonna change my mind. I don't want to change my mind Oh, I want to stay right here, right here Chilling with my friends for another year I would walk away from the spotlight For the good life oh, Come on, turn your hate into poetry Pain into power And I need some friends in your minutes in the hours My first Danish coin this trip I believe it's 1770 or something like that, the massive chunker. And here we have the probably the coat of arm of the king. The middle, some inscription, Danske, maybe Danish shilling. Very nice, very nice. Here in the mud. Whoa, -hoo, this is fun. All right, one coin here, maybe next coin there, third one there. Carry on my wayward son, there'll be peace when I am done. I just dug a ridiculously deep hole and then I went, whoa, I know what I got. Here it is. I recognize this shape any time of the day. Well, might have nicked it with the shovel there in the corner. That, my friends, is a really big axe. How old might it be? Maybe the lumber jack, you know. Yeah. <laughs> is the wood still there? I think so. You have to paint it. Oh, yeah, it's not that old. But it's nice. Yeah, six, seven months old. <laughs> just needs a little sharpening then it's good to go yeah, <laughs> yeah. exactly yeah. excellent thank you this is a pretty awesome looking place you see these nice undulating fields not only do they scream viking to me but they scream bronze age bronze age over there far in the distance is a quarry before they put in the quarry the archaeologists were around they came here, did a dig, and they found a Bronze Age village. How crazy is that? Behind me on that field, maybe you can see it through the bushes, is a big Bronze Age burial mound. And today we have permissions to detect all of these fields. Hooray! Bronze Age, Viking, Iron Age, Metal Age, Stone Age, here I come. Woohoo! Christian found the first bronze thing, maybe. Yeah, I don't know. It looks old. It got the right green. Yeah. But That's maybe ancient. I'll take some coordinates and then then we'll see. Show the museum. It's gonna fit. Yes. Sure. Oh man, it's heavy. Well, maybe it's been in a fire. Yeah, maybe. That is bronze side stuff. Yes, I hope quite, so. Quite, I'm quite sure. Good start. And the next very, very promising looking find. It has that green, dark green, bronze color. Oh man, what could that be? It looks very, very familiar, but I cannot place it. I don't think it's Bronze Age, I think it's medieval. Could be maybe from a key or something. I have seen these things before. I found something, possibly iron or Bronze Age. Looks ancient. It 
it's made of some kind of bronze copper bronze alloy maybe green but then uh, I think it's been in a fire looks like a lump of unrecognizable bronze edge treasure cool where wind did I I was detecting here and then I heard the laughter from behind me and uh, oh, Christian got something What do you got there, buddy? Oh. Nice. Nice silver coin. Silver? Yes, sir. Yeah. I believe it's Norwegian, maybe. How old would that be? 1600s, I think. 1600s? Yes. Beautiful. Morten Beautiful. found one almost like, but mine's better. <laughs> <laughs> of course it is. Yes. <laughs> cool. Nice it's find. a nice one. Nice find. Beautiful, beautiful. He says that he found a more beautiful coin than you. <laughs> yeah, exactly the same. Just, yes. I think mine was bigger and better. No. <laughs> beautiful field, beautiful day. The treasure is out here somewhere, but where? It's a huge field. Having a small break and the other guys are showing me their spectacular finds. And this is Christian's finds. And uh, he says that he has found these dices before. And they are dated to Viking Age or Middle Age borderline. And then he has some other cool stuff. Buttons. Maybe some kind of jewelry. Who knows. We have a monster signal here. A steady, quite steady, 25, 28. Holy smokes! This is the best signal in Denmark so far. If this is treasure, you guys have to like and subscribe. Let's, let's uh, find the treasure then. Man, hope you're as excited as I am. Here we go. No? Oh, oh, oh. It's here. It's here. It's somewhere here. There it is. Oh no. Oh no. Ah. <sighs> Modern kind of treasure. Oh well. That signal was too good to be true anyway. Uh, we're here next to the to the quarry. That's exactly where they found the Bronze Age village. And then they made it into a quarry. Hooray! But uh, we had a great idea. If, we don't know how deep the village was, but if it was uh, below detecting range, then uh, we will have a good chance of Getting deep down in history on those banks. So maybe 20,000, 30,000 years down history up there. So we will metal detect the banks here. Also around the quarry. And see if we can find some excellent Bronze Age stuff. Well the whole damn town has been waiting for the day when you would come back here. There was dancing and talking and steaks on the grill and I think that I will be alright. And my ex from high school still looks just the same as she did back in 2009. Not gonna wait till the morning. Let's never put the night on ice. Never put the night on ice. Oh, I wanna sit right here, right here. Chilling with my friends for another year. I would walk away from the spotlight. I just finished digging this trench here for you guys because I wanted to show you something. It's quite rad. I'm very glad we have a geologist with us today. 
Look at this perfectly preserved crosscut throughout time. Uh, we're missing the top layer of the soil. You can see it there. The, clad, uh, the clay and the mud from, did I call it clad? I don't know, mud clay. It's there, that's what we've been detecting. And when you go beneath the clay, the mud, you get into this. Now we're going back through deep time. Sediments, ocean sediments. This has been the bottom of the ocean once upon a time. I'm just guesstimating here, but maybe we have uh, 20, 30,000 years of history there. And what we're looking for today are finds from the Viking Age or earlier than that, Iron Age, somewhere in the clay part. Maybe when we go to the Bronze Age, we might get down to this top part here of the soil. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I love it. And boom! Here in the deep hole. Nice looking little thing. Button, 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 a beautiful button. Actually, hold on. I believe that over there I found a very similar looking button. Let's have a look. My new treasure box. Gift from the Danish Vikings. Here it is. Is it the same? Same kind of pattern? Uh, almost, almost. It's not a silver one. I believe it's pewter. Oh, look, is the string still there? No. No, that's just some kind of metal. Nice, nice buttons, nice buttons. I made a strange discovery. A white rock, very smooth and round. Potentially could have used, could have been used as a jewelry in the old days. Because uh, as far as I can tell, there's not that many white, smooth, round rocks around here. Electric oil and the company name. Sadly, it's a couple thousand years younger than what I am searching for. I just noticed, by the way, that there's also a burial mound. And if you look around here, across the landscape, you can probably see several. Maybe that could have been one. Bronze Age, Iron Age. In the Bronze Age, they used to put people in big burial mounds around here. And also put lots of swords and silver and gold and knives and everything in the in the mounds. It's incredibly cold and windy today in Denmark and I was thinking that maybe I can open this. I mean I can take a shot on credit, right? I know I haven't found any silver but uh, the next time I find silver, then I don't have to take a shot, you know? So, besides, I'm freezing. I need this. Ah. Wow. I have to finish my beer as well. First I thought this would be the top part of a small dagger or a small knife. But when I cleaned it, I noticed that it has threads on the inside. So probably not then. Oh, uh. So I don't know what it is. It's something. It could still be from a knife. Leave a comment below if you know. Christian made a Viking discovery. Look at that beauty. Nice. The one is fibula. Nice fibula. Yeah. Thousand years old. Yeah. Seems to be missing. The better part is still somewhere out there. Yes, it has to be. Yeah. Just well, keep searching. Well done. <laughs> yeah, nice one. Alright, that will boost the morale a little bit. Yes. Ready to find some more.
it's some kind of a lead handle maybe has served as a button once upon a time I've never seen anything like that so it must be old awesomeness in the hole nice this find will keep me going let's open the treasure box and see my finds the oldest confirmed find today was Christian's fibula from the Viking Age and maybe the oldest ones were those pieces of bronze that were unrecognizable maybe bronze age maybe not what you guys should do now is to subscribe so that you will get a notification of next week's video when I publish it stay in there and thanks for watching see you in a week